<coughs> Hello. Welcome again. It's Thursday, April 11th, 2019. Basically the first video that I'm making in this year. And I am wanting to talk about the way I'm going to do some of my upcoming videos. So here goes. <coughs> I think of doing something different with car show videos. I think instead of keep doing a walkthrough and then showing, well, this car and the, that one just came since I was last recording and doing all these walkthroughs, showing the cars. I think any pictures that I take, I'm going to put into a slideshow. <coughs> yeah, I will just create picture slideshows with Windows Live Movie Maker that I have been using. And I may though, make some intro videos. I mean, just be like short intro videos to it. And anything else that may be going on, I'll record a video of it like anybody singing. <coughs> <coughs> but the fact is, even when the music's playing in the background at the car shows, and that then I end up getting a little bit of a copyright thing on it. So it'd be better off just just use pictures on the slideshow. That's all way of just do it with that, even when they had the car show during the Oktoberfest in October. <coughs> Also, there's always getting these strange phone calls all the time. And some that will say they're coming from Mannington, West Virginia with a Mannington number. And when I call them back, they, they say the number's not in service at this time. And it'll say Mannington, West Virginia on the caller ID. And sometimes it'll be the name and number of somebody that I recognize. Somebody in Mannington. When I answer it, it is some of these, like something about credit card interest, or even people calling. They're talking about knee braces and back braces. Always getting them kind of phone calls too, and those get to be annoying. It's like it's a robo dial call that that's been going around. Calls like that have been going around for years. Always seeing even my own number showing up on my caller ID. <coughs> and that's, they're just so annoying. Never know if it's somebody actually wanting to call and talk to me or any of those people. Or be unknown names calling. And even a three digit number starts with a one, which no phone number actually starts with a one it would be a blocked number of some sort <coughs> this this kind of makes like well five years since I've been making these videos there are maybe one I put up in the summer of 2013 was just an old video I'd recorded in 2006 of some kids on one of those little spin around things at the park shaped like a ladybug like a merry-go-round but yeah I've gotten up to 67 subscribers now <coughs> we'll kind of like to see a lot more on there But I've been thinking about going back and doing kind of a talk on things that happened or like events going on each year of the 2000s. Be like the first 20 years of these, this decade and the last decade from 2000 up to this year of 2019. The most of what I've been doing or been going on since 2014 I've made videos of <coughs> I 
But anything else, we'll talk about some, a lot of events that happened during those times. And some of that stuff will have been things that occurred around here in Mannington, West Virginia, and in generally in some parts of West Virginia, and other national stories and what I thought about them over the years. I may not get very many pictures or videos of that stuff that I could show you, but stuff from newspaper articles, but I will just talk about these people and things. Even going back to things in 2002, 2003, 2004, a lot that happened around here then. <laughs> but that is basically what I'm thinking of doing, and it may take me some time to do all of that. But I'm not going to go back any further, back to things in the 90s and 80s in my lifetime. It's just going to be things from the 2000s. <clears throat> so this is all I want to say, and I would like to see comments about all of this. And what you kind of think about it. And maybe see likes and get some more subscribers. Okay. Thumbs up. <coughs> so, I mean, the weather has gotten warm lately and stayed warm. And like, like last year at this time when had snow happened right in the middle of the month. Like around the 16th and 17th of April last year. I mean, even last year at this time on the 11th, I started wearing shorts up until on the 15th. And then it got cold again. Managed to get warm again for the car show at McDonald's on the 21st of April last year. Compared to like people out in Colorado who are getting a lot of snow right now. Having blizzards. I'm just glad I ain't seeing that anymore right now at this time of year. And hopefully it stays like the warm weather like this. <laughs> uh, not end up even having snow right towards the end of the month. It has done that before back in 2005 and in 2012. <laughs> so goodbye and and that's all